So today I'm going to be showing you how to bag a snake. And uh, the reason you want to bag a snake is if maybe you just found one like on the road or you're looking for one and you found one under some tent or something and you need to take it out of the area, the best way to do it is with some sort of snake bag. But I actually just use a pillowcase. And yeah, this is just a normal pillowcase and do not do this with venomous snakes because they can easily bite through the pillowcase. But this is uh, my snake, Goby, he's a corn snake. So he's gonna be helping me show you how to do this. So first, when you come up to it, you wanna go ahead and have your bag basically ready. And how you wanna do that is open it up. And basically, if you're by yourself, kinda of just open it up just like this. You can't see it, but open it up so that it's kinda of folded down and opened. And then, uh, when you got your snake, it depends how docile it is, but if it's not very happy, you can kind of just grab the end of his tail. It's going to be more freaked out than Gobi is right now because he knows me. And then the best way to do it is to put the snake hook right here, right under him, just as some extra support, and then go head first into the bag as carefully as possible. And then just pull the bag up. You can just use the snake hook for this. And then keep pulling the bag. When you know its head is far away enough, you can just use your hands, pull the bag up, keep pulling like this. Okay, now he's in the bag. Okay, and now since he's at the bottom, I'm gonna place the bag down and kind of keep this up and then cover the very end with my snake hook. And then kind of make sure you do not put this on the snake. And then how I do it is I put my foot on the hook and then I have this right here, so now it's impossible for the snake to get out. And then I can take the bag and roll it up like this, and then you can kind of just pull it up. And at this point, the bag again is at the bottom. You can just keep twisting and then knot it. Knot the twist like that. And now, You've got your snake in the bag, just like this. And again, he technically can bite through this bag, so you're not gonna want to put your hands here. I know he's not going to, but a more angry snake would, and definitely a venomous snake is possible, uh, able to. So only get a bag that actually uh, basically works for venomous snakes. And they can just take him wherever you can put it in your backpack like this, if the backpack is padded enough so that they can't bite you through this. Uh, but this keeps the snake calm. They actually feel pretty comfortable in here. Uh, but you want to take it out as quickly as possible. They can get air through this, air can go through it so they won't suffocate. But yeah, then once you are where you want to put it, like if you're in a new safer location or just wherever you're going to put it, you can just untie it, take it, let it unravel, and then lie it down very carefully, and then just take the back and very slowly and carefully pull it up like this until the, your snake comes right out the front and it looks like he doesn't want to come out and then again you can use your snake hook to kind of guide the snake out of the bag just like that so that's what I think is the quickest and easiest way to bag a snake um, again this is Gobi he's my snake and he's really calm so chances are the snake isn't going to be this docile when you're doing that. Uh, you kind of just have to play it by ear like that. But that's, if you can kind of do it like that, that's the safest way to do it. For the snake, it's a cheap way to do it. Pillowcases aren't expensive, snake hooks aren't expensive. You might not even need a snake hook, but I recommend using one. But yeah, that's just about all you have to do for that. And thanks for watching. <laughs>